do I fall in love with every girl I see that smiles? He was one of these people who didn't belong in New York, but didn't belong anywhere else. So he came from the Midwest, where he must have been so completely uh, isolated in his own personal world. At least he was in amongst other weird people. So he didn't fit in, but he was amongst others. They're always so pretty. Even the ones who aren't pretty are pretty. He just, he was from a different era. He was such a lonely individual. I mean, he told me that uh, people used to stare at him on the subway, and I, I can see why. And there's this guy doing puppets for, for the kids and scaring the shit out of them. I went to his house, and it was really strange. Maybe I just need to climb out of my own head. Walter really wasn't a musician and didn't really understand music or know a lot about it, I thought I'd give it a, a sort of grander name. So I called it uh, the Walter Skin and Motorboat Sunshine Orchestra. It, it, you know, it was a one-off. And then I came across, you know, the Walter Skin record and did some research online. I couldn't find anything. And, and I put it on and, and it really wasn't like anything else I'd heard before. That was a wreck. I was, that was all over the place. That was, that was a, a bad, dark place. Jenny was the love of his life. A song about first love, about true love, uh, about possibly the only woman that Walter ever loved. And knowing Walter, he was probably really intense and scared her off. He started to seem a little bit more, even more introverted towards the end. He used to put off everybody, hell, man. Walter was difficult. We just sort of drifted apart. No one knows really what happened to Walter. He sort of went off planet and... Well, he just disappeared off the face of the earth. I mean, I, I knew him vaguely and then all of a sudden he wasn't there. The man was an enigma. Uh, who knows why he did anything, why he lived his life. I don't know.